This lesson moves on to a more thorough survey after the brief A, B, C, D, E. In the second assessment, you will focus on the history and physical examination involving the patient, his or her family, and any witnesses. In terms of history, use the acronym SPAM, signs and symptoms, past medical history, allergies, and medications. When checking signs and symptoms, evaluate recent events related to the current problem, such as preceding illnesses or dangerous activity. Then examine the patient from head to toe for consciousness, delirium, agitation, anxiety, depression, fever, breathing, appetite, nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. When looking into the patient's past medical history, look for the birth history, previous hospitalizations, and any surgeries he or she may have had. Allergies. Has the victim been exposed to any of their allergens? Medications. Could the child have taken any inappropriate medications or substances? As far as the physical examination goes, use your reports from SPAM to prompt specific examinations. For example, a report on past breathing difficulties would prompt you to do a thorough airway and lung examination. The AHA also recommends that you work from head to toe and to make use of diagnostic tools. That's all for this lesson. Next, we'll discuss life-threatening issues.